So why when there are so many fantastic reels in the Preston Innovations range, do you always hear me talking about the extremity? Now for me, this reel has, it, it literally changed my fishing. And I know that's a huge statement to make, but it really did because as you guys know, I love to get out there and do some feeder fishing on all different types of venues, commercials, natural rivers, big reservoirs, canals, everything. I really love getting out there and feeder fishing. But when you're feeder fishing, naturally you're in and out all the time. You're winding in all the time, okay, but often you're pulling back heavier weights. So for me, with a lot of the fishing I do, I might be fishing for, say, small skimmers or roach or anything like that. I might have a feeder on that's quite heavy and big and open and it takes some dragging through. This is where the extremity gets all of its credit because you can see I've picked up the most battered one I had. That is absolutely battered to hell, all right? I have hammered this reel over at least three years. And it doesn't matter if it's pouring it down with rain or if I'm winding in a fish every chuck, this reel will just continue to wind in. And that is what I want from a reel. Now you're thinking to yourself, well, surely all reels do that, but they don't. When you get fast, really highly engineered reels, when they get to winding in heavy weights all the time. It takes out that almost beauty of them. It takes out the, the fineness of them, all the, all the intricacies that are in that reel, the oil gets a little bit. Anything has to be slightly out and it won't work the same. You might, you've heard it, you've had a reel before you wind in anything, that doesn't sound quite right. You don't get any of that in the extremity. So for me, when I'm out fishing on a commercial and I'm winding in a method feeder or a waggler and I'm pumping in my carp, I'll always go for a centrist because the centrist is just an absolute thing of beauty to have on my rod. When I'm out there in a situation where I'm catching lots of fish or I'm winding in like an open style feeder, something that's going to wobble about, something that I'm going to be in and out all the time, it will always, always be the extremity. So if I'm braid fishing, it's the extremity for everything. Again, if I'm out there, like for example, this reel was just recently used on the river and I was fishing big open feeders in two ounce, fishing for barbel. There's only one reel that I was gonna have on my rod. It has to be this reel so I can wind my fish in all the time or I can wind that feeder in all the time. Super, super reliable. And amazingly, incredibly cost effective. One of the cheapest reels actually on the market and I'm saying probably the best.